Hey guys, my name's Tim, and this is my wife, Dana. Together we have two kids, our super cute daughter, Hannah, and our little guy, Zeke. We've been married since 2006, and this is a video about our life. Here's where I'm working today, Kurt. I, uh, I came here because I did a speed test on my phone outside on their Wi-Fi, and it was like super fast. So I came in here, I'm like, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll work here. But there's no plug outlets in any of the walls around here. Like, anywhere, no plug outlets. So the battery's only got like an hour left. <laughs> and the speed test was a fluke, and it's actually just as normally slow as it is here anywhere else in town. So I'm here, I'm breaking. But probably my time. I'm trying to catch up on some support to get requests for uh, ministry websites, that is. Here. Tried uploading the vlog from yesterday, I got that edited, but just uh, um, I don't have enough battery left on my computer to get the whole thing uploaded. So I'm um, just doing some work, kind of catch up on my email, blog post, get things queued up. So, like, things auto post for me while I've gone at VidCon uh, on just from various websites. So, a lot to do, a lot to get ready. Dana is out uh, for the evening. So I got Zeke here trying to just hang on my leg, <laughs> and Hannah. Like Sam hey Hannah. And Wong, this kind of Hi. Guy. I She's watching Here's Shay Tards. Right and I gotta keep the this video so content. little on my screen because our internet here has been ridiculously slow. And that's the, well see it still stops the buffer. I've called our tech support several times in the past couple months because we're only getting like a quarter of the speed we pay for and they sent two people out here to try to fix it it's still unresolved and no matter what I do I can't get them to fix it or reimburse us any money for not having our speed so which is really annoying because I live on the internet I can't even send a tweet ridiculous god right little Zeeks isn't that ridiculous don't you think so you just want me to play with you, huh? You say, Daddy, give me attention. Okay. Zeke's down for his evening nap, so it's time for me and Hannah to spend some father-daughter time together outside. It's because it was it's cooler outside than it is inside now. So look at, didn't Dad do a good job out here? Well, I did that part. <laughs> but like the weeding for like the rest of this, <clears throat> you get well you guys probably didn't see it but like all along like the edge right there it's all that was weeded full of weeds along the side of the house right down there <clears throat> and like this this whole part of our driveway which we don't use like that was all full of weeds and the beds on there oh it was it was a mess Dan did a good job i think those are all sticks we need to get rid of that either mo mommy picked up or the lawn guy picked up because he couldn't mow with them on the on the grass. Yeah, it's sprinkling a little bit. A little bit of rain. Feels good though. What? Daddy, huh? You want daddy to throw the ball up there? You want, you want daddy to show you his mad basketball skills? Okay. <laughs> you guys ready for this? I don't think you are. Here we go. Ready? Whee! Oh, rejected. Try that again. Ready? One handed shot. Oh, reject it again. Here we go. Third time's the charm. Except for with me. <laughs> oh, it still is. Check it out. You proud of Daddy? He made it. Say yay, Daddy. Yay, Daddy. <laughs> yay. You're my little cheerleader. Do a little dance. Debt free and loving it. DaveRamsey.com. <laughs> Those are the stickers Dana and I each have one in our car because you want daddy to throw the ball up there some more? Okay. Okay, here we go. Oh, left-handed shot. No bueno. Here, Hannah, try. No. No? Okay. We uh, for, became debt-free. Um, what was that? It was on election day when Obama was elected in. That's the day we paid off my last of my school loans. No, yes, oh, I will, Hannah. One minute, let Daddy finish vlogging here. <laughs> and uh, so we've been debt free ever since. Love it. I mean, the government. <laughs> Dave, I saw Dave Ramsey did a tweet earlier today. He's like, I know the best way to get out of debt is to spend more money. He's, he's like, that's like trying to tell an alcoholic the best way to recover is to drink more, you know? So 
I don't know. The whole thing's a mess, the whole government thing. I obviously have a pretty strong opinion about it. I think if, ever, if no one had debt, we would all be much better off, including this country, you know? Uh, people are like, well, you can't do big stuff. Like, how you need debt but for the economy to go around. It's like, if, if no one had any debt at all, the economy was better off. Oh, Hannah, you fall? So, kids, as you go off to school, stay away from credit cards, uh, student loans if you can, stay away from all that stuff. Uh, I made it through undergrad going to a small private little college. Uh, I made it through debt free, so I totally know it's possible. I worked my butt off for three jobs. Oh, there you go. You kicked the ball. Now it's bye bye. <laughs> Where's the ball? Where's the ball? It's over there. Let's go get it. So, yeah, I worked my butt off doing uh, three jobs and didn't really have a whole college experience, you know, as far as the expensive dorm living and food plans and going out with friends and eating out and all that stuff. That's way expensive and I promise you guys, it is not worth the cost. Ready? Woo, mosquitoes down here, woo! Get it! Uh-oh, get it, it's gonna roll back down to daddy. Whoop. People will tell you like, oh, but you need a credit score, you need to have good credit, so you need to get a credit card so by the time you graduate, um, you know, you can get a mortgage and get a car <laughs> and go into more debt for stuff. Uh, that's what I did, and I so wish I hadn't. I promise you guys, a credit score is only measures your ability to borrow and pay back money. So if you don't borrow money, you don't go into debt, you don't need a credit score. There's a couple services, like we set up your TV, they'll run a quick credit check just to see if they'll give you your service or not. But other than that, um, like if you do a mortgage, you can uh, have people just manually look at your finances and, and uh, yeah, I know, you put the bob back down there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go get it again. Um, or uh, they'll just, it's called manual underwriting, they'll just manually look at your finances. Um, or if you're trying to get the cable TV set up or something and they want to do a credit check on you, all you gotta do is like submit your bank statement or something and you're good to go. So there's ways to get around it. Make a short story long for you. Stay away from debt. This country would be much better off if we had. And Dan and I definitely are so glad we are. Okay, enough of the lecture. Time to play with Anna. Yeah? Okay. Here comes the shot, left-handed from Daddy. You ready? Say go. Go. Okay. Left-handed. Oh, not even close. Yesterday I asked you guys about weed killer, and Renzetta gave me her recipe. I'm gonna try it because that's the one I have the uh, ingredients on hand for. She said to use um, one cup of ordinary table salt with um, one gallon of vinegar, which we got that. And then slowly add in one tablespoon of any dishwashing liquid. So we'll try that, put it in there, and see how that weed killer works. So you kind of get that little extra stuff that Dana missed. There goes all the vinegar into the salt. Ah. See how it works. You don't like this stuff, Anna. It stinks, huh? It's, this stuff does smell really bad. Yeah, I made it, I made it wet. Hannah spilled a whole bunch of crumbs on the couch, so I had to vacuum them up with this. And now we're having fun playing with it. Right? Hey, Zeke. I'm going to give you a kiss. Woo! You like it? Look at that belly. Woo! <laughs> Here, Hannah's turn. Hannah, touch it. It wants to give you a kiss. She likes it. She likes playing with the vacuum. Yeah, it's fun, huh, little guy? Yeah, yeah, Hannah's turn. No. Are you scared of it? 